The faces of tentative hope on these refugees say it all. They're hungry and exhausted, many of them unwell from a treacherous journey. But at least they're closer to their dream of reaching Europe. They're among the thousands rescued in the Mediterranean Sea this weekend. We have several people with scabies. Uh, we see fruit because uh, they've been in very, very poor living condition, possibly in detentions in, in the last uh, month. Uh, we have many people who have suffered uh, violence, physical violence and torture. From late Friday into Sunday afternoon, aid organizations conducted dozens of rescues non-stop. It's believed improving spring weather may have accounted for the spike in crossings. The refugees were travelling on all too familiar vessels, rickety and stretched beyond capacity. Several drowned. The rescues were complex with numerous boats spotted. We immediately contacted the Maritime Rescue Coordination Centre, which called other ships in the area to help in the operations. So far this year, around 32,000 refugees have arrived on European shores. It's a noticeable drop from the peak of the crisis two years ago, but still a telling figure of the many willing to risk everything to escape conflict and poverty. Gerald Tan, Al Jazeera.